Hi, you guys. It's Cassandra Reed, your marketing tool diva. Yay! Anyway, I wanted to uh, come back with another tutorial for you guys. I'm going to show you how to upload pictures from your desktop computer or your laptop computer to Instagram. And we're going to do that with the little tool that I found. So how about we go ahead and get started. Um, now I'm going to pull up my web browser here. This is uh, one of my Instagram accounts. This is one I just started. I have all these funny pictures on my computer and I wanted some place to put it other than Facebook. I don't want to put it all on Facebook. So I came up with a um, Instagram page called Epic Craft Happens. Um, so let me show you the tool we're going to be using. Uh, sorry you guys, I forgot. I had to turn off my internet connection for just a second because my virus control was going crazy. So now we're going to go to Grambler dot com. Bam. Alright, so Grambler is a tool that you're going to use. This is a cool little tool. You're really, really going to like this. It's great for Windows and it's also great for Mac. So all you Mac users out there, don't panic. You can use this. Okay, so now what you're going to do is you're going to figure out which one you have. You have a Windows computer, you have a Mac computer. You're going to come over here and you're going to download this to your system. Um, I'm going to give you a minute to do that. As soon as you get it downloaded, you uh, come back to this video. Just hit pause, do that, come right back, okay? Go ahead. All right, so I'm going to assume that you're already done with that. So we're going to close this window, and we're going to go and open up Grambler. I want to show you how Grambler works. So we're going to open this little puppy up. This is what it looks like when you first open it. So we're going to put in your Instagram username. In this case, it's Epic Crap Happens. And my password. Oh, wait. Let me try that again. Okay. And log in. And this is what it looks like. Now, I want you to notice something. Um, you choose your file here and you upload it here, but your picture has to be 650 pixels by 650 pixels in order for it to be able to go on Instagram. Now it says here that you can use Web Resizer. I've used it before. I've used Pic Resizer. I don't like the commercials. I don't like having to go through the commercials and all of the other foolishness to get it done. So I use Microsoft Paint. Now I'm going to show you how I use Microsoft Paint. Hopefully it'll help you too. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to a folder where I already have pictures. Just funny stuff that I want to put in there. And I am going to go with ba 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 ba. Let's go with animal crap. Okay. And we're just going to choose one of these pictures here. There was one I saw. Yeah, here he is. He's the rhinoceros with the tiger stripes. So we're going to right click on that picture and we're going to open that picture with paint. Ah, there he is in all his glory. All right. So now we're going to resize this picture. So what you're going to do is come up here to your toolbar, you're going to click resize, you're going to click pixels, and you're going to unclick maintain aspect ratio. Because if you don't, you can, you're going to put 650 here and it's going to change the vertical to something completely different. We need it both the same. So unclick this and put in 650 by 650 and click OK. And boom, he is ready for Instagram. Now, if you want to put something on here, maybe a saying, turn it into kind of a meme to put on there, you can actually come up here. Uh, let's change the color of the font because I don't think the black is going to show up really well. So let's change the color of the, the font to white. Let's click this. And uh, let's see, let's double click it. I want to, yeah, let's click that. And then we're going to come down here and put, uh, let's see. Here, I'm going to resize this a little bit, make it go all the way over, and I'm going to put shh, I'm a tiger. Okay, and click off of it, and bam, you just turned that into a meme. How cool is that? You can draw on this, there's different brush styles that you can use if you wanted to actually write something on here. You have your paint brush, uh, paint bucket. You can change the colors, fill, put color fills in. You can write with a pencil. You have an eraser, all kinds of things. You can put different shapes on here, arrows, whatever you want to do. If you're doing marketing and you wanted to use a meme for your, um, for your, uh, uh, a 
write something on your your picture for your campaign you can do it right here this is so great I, I really like using this here little tool alright so now we've got this I'm a tiger and he's ready to go on my Instagram epic crap happens page so now all I have to do is save him and I'm gonna save him as he saved as a JPEG but I'm gonna put him in my Instagram folder. I made a folder called Instagram because everything in there has already been sized. Uh, yes, let's replace the one that's in there. So now he's in my Instagram folder and he's ready to go on Instagram. So let's close this and let's close this and let's go to Grambler. Pull it back up. Now we're gonna choose our file. So, oh, there it is. Okay, so let's go to Instagram. Open that up and we're going to choose this guy open him up all right there he is and we're going to click upload now it gives you also the option to put a caption under your picture i love that so you can write whatever you want on uh underneath your picture before it even goes on your instagram account you can do hashtags you can do a link you can do whatever it is that you want to put there so uh let's just put um o m g laugh out loud he thinks he's a tiger uh hashtag get your life <laughs> okay and we're gonna save that caption now how cool is this once you've done that, you have different places that you can you can share your um, your link to for your picture, and you can also use these links here to put on your web page, to put on your blog page. You have an HTML code. You've got a web link. You've got a direct link. Um, I'm not sure what forum BBC code is. I'm assuming this is something that you can use when you're posting in forums. You can share it on Facebook or Twitter. Very very cool. And when you want to upload another picture. All you do is click upload another and start all over again. Okay, so now we're going to go back over here. I'm going to put that down. I'm going to refresh my Instagram page. And bam, there's my tiger on my Instagram page. And when we pull him up, uh, oops, sorry about the language there. <laughs> Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Oh, I just saw him. Oh, there he is. Double clicking. Ah, there he is. OMG, he thinks he's a tiger. Hashtag get your life. So there he is. Okay. So cool. Now, the only thing I don't see, it looks like the hashtag is not highlighted. So I may have to go back in and do something with that. Let's see. I wonder, how, I wonder if I can. Maybe there. Hmm. Okay. Oh well. Anyway, um, we'll figure that out because you should be able to. And maybe I put a space there when I wasn't supposed to. We'll see. Anyway, um, that's basically it. That's how you use Grambler. That's how you put pictures from your computer onto your Instagram account. So if you have any questions or if you can think of anything else you can do with it, or if you like it or not, it you know, just let me know. <laughs> Click on the link below. You can follow me on Facebook. You can also follow me on Twitter. Subscribe to my YouTube page so you can get more stuff like this. And um, I hope you like it. I hope you can use it. All right, you guys. Thanks a lot. Talk to you later. Bye.